Hey everyone, I'm Brad Nelson. And I'm Todd Stevens. And you're watching the Versus series on StarCityGames.com. So this week on the Versus series, we're going to have a little fun. Oh yeah, just like uh, last week. Just like, yes. Last week we had fun with real modern decks. This mm -hmm. week we're going to... We're gonna unban a few things and, okay. and see, and and this this video is mostly for Shaheen Sarani, who has been talking about Jace the Mind Sculptor mm -hmm. getting unbanned for as long as it's been banned, right? Pretty much so since the the format came. Yeah, around. he wants his pet card. Yeah, he wants his pet card back, and a lot of people are on the opposite side that are saying this card you you do not think it should be unbanned. Oh, no, no, I don't either. If, I don't even think today we're going to be putting it up against Bloodbraid Elf. Mm -hmm. Done with Bloodbraid, we didn't even unban Deathrite Shaman or any of the other cards for either deck. Right. Just Blood Red Elf versus Jace dual decks, pretty much. <laughs> yeah. It's just Jun versus Jeskai, and we're going to hopefully show you firsthand how Jace on turn four isn't good. Attritioned okay. out Jun, Jace on turn eight is game over. Yeah. It, it should almost shut the door immediately. Mm -hmm. That plus holding ma counter magic up. I, I don't really know how a deck can like come back from that. Right. Um, a lot of people say that like Blood Red Elf was like the like ban of or bane of jace you know like it was like the car that could beat jace with like getting blightnings and just mm -hmm. being a three power attacker with haste or lightning bolts and stuff and i don't think that's true i, I think jace either. is too good <laughs> I, I do too i i am so. very scared and i'm not even scared of jace in this deck i'm scared of mm -hmm. like jace out of combo sideboards i'm scared mm -hmm. of jace out of noble hierarch decks yeah like jace out of control like is as fair as the card can get but the card can get busted in so many ways like you bring in all this anti combo stuff in certain matchups like Storm, yeah. and they just turn three Ritual out of Jace and tick up and then win the yeah. game from there. So you have like Amulet Titan, which is like a great game one deck that's easily disruptible, then you just bring in Jace the Mind Sculptor. Well, that's that's a stretch for the mana, but I do agree yeah. with you. It's just combo decks can bring in Jace and win the game. But anyway, that's what we're going to do. We're going to see if Jace can take over a Jun deck, but I, you know, we, we we'll already... see how good Bloodbraid is at fighting it. Yeah, or just Bloodbraid in general of trying to get card advantage against uh, Jeskai because one mm -hmm. of the things about this matchup is Jeskai can attrition Jund out really easily. Mm -hmm. Jund has a really tough time dealing with all the two-for-ones on the other side of the field. Now we get to finally see what it can do with its own. Right. So that'll so. be fun, but we're going to roll some dice. We're going to play some uh, Jund versus Jeskai and have a little fun with some stuff banned from Modern, but not everything banned. We yeah, talked, we talked about cards. doing that, and I didn't want to do that. Yeah. <laughs> all right, 7-Eleven game. Oh, right, 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 right. oh, that was the oh, first time, time I didn't roll a seven right away. I always roll seven right oh, away. Oh, that would have been a delight. All right, well, this is a delight. It does feel good to see Blood Red Elf in an opening hand again. I'm not going to lie. All right, you good? Yeah, I'm good. All right, well, we're going to start off with my favorite start, Black Thief. Oh, no. Thoughtsies. So... Yeah, we're kind of relying on the path there because the rest of our hand is quite slow. But... Yeah, I'm going to take the path because I want this Dark Confidant to do work. Yeah. All right, so two Flooded. Two Cryptic. Two Cryptic. Snap and Colonnade. What? Yes. What? What? Come on. Go ahead. <sighs> Maybe you have an Opt. Maybe you have a Path. Maybe you have a Spell Snare. <sighs> Well, I'm I'm gonna find out. 18 Dark Confidant. Maybe I have a bolt. Uh, you're so lucky. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm at 16 to yep. 17. And I'll be at 17. You're so lucky. It's unbelievable how lucky you get. <laughs> Thank you. Thank when you. I heard you didn't do well in day one of the invitation, I was shocked. <laughs> yeah, it was just not my weekend. That's that's how basically all my turns have gone this this year. I've always done like really well, or I just like don't win a match. You know, so that, I take all my losses in the same that tournament. That is better than, you know, x 4 in every single tournament. Right. Good. Oh, well, I left a good one on top. Oh, dang, that was not a good one. <laughs> all right, go ahead. <laughs> that was probably the worst they could draw. All right, Tarmogoyf. Oh, no. Rage and Ruby, near turn. All right, how big is the Tarmogoyf? The Tarmogoyf looks to be a 4-5 already. Um, I think we just get that. Okay. 4-5. Just an island, not the colony? Uh, I have another Flooded Strand. Or not another flood strand. Okay, I think yeah, I so. guess I guess we're gonna snap. Yeah, because we're just gonna be snap pathing. Uh, I should have just dealt with that. Whatever. But this just trades with it. Fine. All right, I'm going to attack you. All right. Um. So I could take four. 
No. I mean, I would I would just snap half. Let's yeah. let's let's be real. So this does let you like if you hit like fatal push. That's nice now. Yeah. All right. So uh, let's see. I'm at 17. You're at 16. Okay. All right. Give me a good cut. All right. Bloodbright Elf, spin the wheel. Second main Bloodbright Elf. <laughs> Second like main phase. Card is broken. <laughs> Inquisition, you. Oh, uh, well, I got trips commands. <laughs> <laughs> Triptic command. <laughs> Go. <laughs> this card is disgusting. It should stay on the band list. <laughs> it's too good. <laughs> Go. Well, no plays over here. So unlucky. Man, that's gross. That could be bad. Um... I'm gonna be fetching while you're waiting. While you're in response around. to your fetch. Oh, whatever. <laughs> when would you have fetch? Well, in response to your spell, whatever spell you cast. Well, I might not cast a spell. Okay. Well, if you go to combat, then it'd be. So. Well, I guess yeah, it would just be because I wouldn't even do anything before combat. So yeah. Just All right. Whenever I'm, you cast a spell. I'm gonna animate Rage and Ravine. Okay. I'm gonna go to combat. Um. I think I'll let you go to combat. Right. Yeah, I'll let you Attack go combat. Trigger. All right, now do I have? I guess I have supreme verdicts that are double. All right, so we'll just get more planes. Um, okay, so I'm at 17. I could take that, go to 13. I think that's. Or I could just bounce it. Could go bounce draw card. I guess I would just. I think I want to do bounce draw card. So bounce draw card. Okay. I I picked up my line. I'm not gonna cast tap my line. Play okay. my line first. Go. Ooh, baby. Well, I could get down my favorite card in the deck. Search for Escanta. Yep, it's my favorite card in the deck. But then I don't get to hold up a cryptic command. But I think that's still worth it because this card's so cool. So we're gonna play search, land and tapped. Go ahead. This is an interesting turn. I'm gonna play land. Um, I guess you could logic knot, but whatever, that's fine. All right, I'm going to pulse the search. Man. All right, fatal push the snapcaster. Did you know when you have your search like transformed, you can still put EE on two and blow it up? Wow, really? Yeah, because it's still CMC two. That's awesome. Yeah, isn't but that awesome? A, does EE say non-land? Oh, E does say non-land, doesn't it? So you can't. Okay, so Ratchet, Ratchet Bomb's non-land too? Yeah, they're all non-land. Ah, dang it. Never mind. <laughs> but you, but I, cool thought. Uh, yeah, cool thought. All right, push your Snapcaster Mage. Rats. Thank you. I'll path it. All right. I was your trying. turn. Because I just think lands with CMC are cool. Hmm. Well, uh... I have cards that get cast on your turn, so I'm not going to cast them on my <laughs> turn. <laughs> 15. So I'll pass my turn. All right, left you with the time good. All right. I guess I need one red over here. So we'll keep those. Combat attack. Uh, yeah, in response to trigger. All right. He looks that. So I'll gain three, go back up to 20. Dark confidant. Ha ha. Ha 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 All right, all right. All right. You're at 19, yeah. 19. You're okay. Ah, yeah, I didn't write down my second fetch. That's a good point. Hmm. Well, I guess I'll have to cast this card that I just drew. Come on! <laughs> are you serious? How nope. are you even a real person? <laughs> Wait, Brad, did I draw a good card? Is that, is that what happened? This is unreal. <laughs> oh, well, I guess I'll have to leave up a cryptic command now. Go ahead. All right, I can see it. I'm done. <laughs> done. This game's over. All right, so for game two, I because of my mana, I can't really... I have to pick up play pattern, and I think it's deploying Confidant after ripping apart the hand, and hopefully it works. Isn't that just the normal play pattern? Well, but this time it's like these are the lands, so I can't... 
Ah, uh, yeah. Like, I can either go for turn two, Bob, or, like, hand disruption, hand disruption, try to play it on turn three. Yeah, I got you, I got which you. Which I think I'm going to do. Okay. So, we didn't like, don't like the hand disruption there, because we got a bunch of fours and a bolt. Okay, well, I'm going to take the bolt. Yeah. Because we going. definitely want to get this. Jace. Jace. Cryptic Command. Verdict. Flooded Strand. Glacial Fortress. Glacial Celestial Colonnade. Alright, and we'll just play our Colonnade in there. Go ahead. Alright. Ho, 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 ho. <laughs> Go. Well, I already drew a removal spell. So. Come on! Are you serious? Helix. What is it? How is this real life? <laughs> like... Um, so it's basically whether I want to shock or not. I don't like shocking, but we're gaining three also. So actually, sure, we'll, we'll go and shock. Thoughtsies. All right, so yeah, you already know the hand. All right, I'll take the Jace. All right. Hase down. Go. How is this? <laughs> oh. Hmm. I didn't draw a good card there. What a surprise. Go ahead. So sad for you. Because I didn't Go. need to. Okay, okay. We can deal with that. You can deal with my Go ahead. ravines. Hmm. So my only win cons in my deck are Jace, Colonnade, and Snap. Those are the only ones. Seems like enough. Yeah. Whatever. Blood Bright Elf, trigger. Yeah. Charm of Life. All right, that's good, that's good. Okay, so we could could counter something here with a Cryptic, or we could just let this happen and then Verdict, but then if we just let it happen Verdict, we could be, um, could be under the gun from something else. So what if I just, I think I could just, all right, how big is this Goyf? Yeah, it's huge, all right. Could just, Cryptic the Goyf and take three from the Elf. What are I think, life totals? I think that's what we're gonna 20 do. 20 to 16? Yeah. All right, I'm going to 19. I'm going to uh, cryptic counter the Goyf and draw a card. All right. And then I'll take three from Bloodbraid. I'm going to go to 16. And your turn. All right, untap, draw. Hmm. Go ahead. Inquisition. Cast it just let you have one of these. Oh, hmm. Do you have two Snapcasters already? Yeah. <laughs> this is not even real. Yeah. I mean, so I could. All right. So I could just play both the snaps and just have a bolt yeah, and just bolt a, that. Take a snap. Or I could just let you take a snap. I could. I'm thinking about just flashing them both in in response to the Inquisition and then just targeting bolt. I don't, no, I don't think that's right. All right, so. I don't think it's that bad. Yeah, it's not that. Mm. No, you, you can have a snap. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna play him. I'll take three. All 13. Right, yeah, 13. Go. Good. 15. So I think what I'm most scared of is the ravines, not the blood red elf. Steam vents and a hollow fountain. And I'm just going to go ahead and snap. Mm. Want to snap Helix? No. All right, untap. Go. All right, so I'm at 11. Does that sound right? Just fetch twice? Yeah. So 11 13? to yep. six to fifteen. Okay. Eleven fifteen. 
Oh, animate colony. Yep. On block. Yep. Dill two, do it and bring back Bloodbred Elf. Ooh, that's nice. Um, I'll add a blue mana. Well, this is in combat. Okay. All right. End of combat. Okay. All right. Second main. Yep. Let's just hope to get lucky. All right. Go. This at least forces a verdict. It would have been nicer to hit like a Liliana or another K command hmm. or a hand disruption spell. But if, if he's forced to wrath this ooze away, that means that I can at least make a Rage Ravine a 4 4 so that he has to use his top powers to draw Path to Exile like he will. Yeah. Let's, let's <laughs> or do all or that. already have. <clears throat> All right, my turn. Yep. Uh, animate attack. All right, I'm down to seven. There's hope in this game. I don't yeah. like this. Go. There's definitely hope for you. Ooh, <laughs> sack of land. <laughs> Sharding visions. <laughs> um, I don't want either of those cards. Put those at the bottom. Go ahead. So we drew, we didn't draw land. Animate attack. Um we'll play snappy. Target. Lightning helix. Terminate. Spell snare. Mm hmm. Yep, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, all right. So grumble, 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 lock grumble. Lock in Helix. 10. Go. Go back up to 10. Taking my time grumble, here. Grumble, grumble, grumble. Untap real slowly. Ooh. All right, so... Um, okay, we don't really have anything for Raging Ravines yet, but let's see if we find something. So let's play this, Jace. Right. Go ahead and zero. Draw three. Oh man, that feels good. I haven't done that before. <laughs> Put two back. <laughs> you never activated Jace before? <laughs> Not in a long time. Um, yeah, we'll just put both those back. All right, go I ahead. I like how on theme I am of just... <laughs> <laughs> Quad Ravine? Oh no, that's no, a Tommy Grab, yeah. It, but then it's just two different variants. Oh yeah, it's just either black, red, or green, red. Pulse. You just have one left? Yep. Hmm. So you could just go land, activate, ravine. It's tough. Um, land, activate, ravine is probably the scariest thing. I think I might just let that happen. Because I'm more scared of the ravine than having Jace stay around. So have enough like cards and, and everything. Okay, um, you just have one activation? Mm-hmm. Hmm. I'll counter unless you pay. Why would you? You should Three. have kept your Jace alive. You know I never draw well. Against <laughs> you. I never go perfect, perfect sequencing. All right, well, we know it's on top. Scry two. Um, I don't think I need more lands. I need more cards to do stuff with. So we'll just put those both on the bottom. Mm -hmm. um, try again. Draw. Scry two. Don't need either of those cards. Put those both at the bottom. And we'll play search for tomorrow. Search for Trascanta. No, I wish it was today. search for tomorrow. <laughs> search for today. <laughs> Combat attack trigger. Felix. All right, I concede. So I'll go to 13. I give up. I'm demoralized. Hooray. Yeah, I know. I know. Your card's good. And I was just drawing lands. All right. All right. So for sideboarding, I'm going to be bringing in a smattering of random cards. <laughs> I, I, I've got my haste Jace killer. Okay. My can't touch this killer. Yep. My, you know, fair game killer. I've got this Liliana that's going to hopefully help grind some card advantage. And I'm only bringing one Collector Brutality. I'm taking out a lot of the spot removal, but I'm keeping in, like, the pulses. And the deck has a few extra bigger spells to fight Jace kind of stuff. 
Um, and so I, I thought about maybe taking a Liliana of the Veil out of the deck for this collective fertility for another one, just because I, I sometimes could see a game where I'm trying to Veil and you're trying to chase and I'm just, I get <laughs> dominated. Right. Um, but whatever, we're going to keep it as close to Jund as possible and just hope that we can find an answer to Jace if it ever yeah. uh, presents itself. Over here, I don't really like how I'm sideboarding, but I don't <laughs> really have a better idea. Uh, I, was, I would this expect is some kind of. This man is like all the time. I, uh, I, I could expect uh, some graveyard hate and um, logic. Not I don't know, just kind of counter some stuff. It's not. I like I like uh, answering things after they're on the battlefield personally instead of countering stuff. So that's why I'm doing that. I don't know if it's you know correct or or anything, but um, yeah, ruined halos could definitely get abrupt K or maelstrom pulsed, but. Oh well, um, and we're shaving one of the verdicts because as we saw, it seemed like we could have like enough answers like for one mm -hmm. for one. We don't really need as many verdicts. So, uh, bringing in detention sphere for planeswalkers, kind of worried about that. Uh, Rune Taylor can just take out all of the raging ravines, and we don't have to worry about trying to kill every single raging ravine. So, that could be nice. All right, so we're back for game three, and this does not. This looks like a standard hand. It does <laughs> not look like a modern hand, but I'm gonna keep I, it. I actually kind of have a standard hand over here too. I got the Spire Bluff Canal Sulfur Falls combo. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there you go. <clears throat> um, I'm gonna start with the Flood Strand. All right, go. Oh wow. Nothing yet. All right, let's get... We definitely need white mana, so I guess... Well, gotten. I'm pretty sure what happened is I didn't shuffle enough, but mm. whatever. Because we've got a lot of our sideboard cards in our hand. <laughs> oh, wow. But it doesn't look like a real deck start. Yeah. I I probably shuffled enough. It could just be one of those small sample size things. Oh, I didn't shuffle standard, John, all. where you just start playing a bunch of Mythics on, like, yeah. turn three. Let's see what happens. Oh, wait. Uh, I want my Fire Bluff Canal down first. Sorry. Ooh, ooh, I like I like where this game's going. Oh no, I definitely like where this game's going. Don't pulse my Ascanta. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to resolve one of my good spells, and you're going to have the one detention spear for it because that's who you are. Ooh, all right, all right, go. Upkeep. Don't need another one. <laughs> Of course you'd get to mill <laughs> Um We're not playing anything for three mana here, so let's just play this one. All right. I have to make Tarmogoyf bigger. <laughs> oh, man. Can't beat that card ever. <laughs> go. Um, Better wrath it this turn. Yeah. Let's go ahead and uh, end step Helix this. Down to two. Down to two. Untap. Let's draw. Hmm. So what are you at now? So I am at what, what, 19. What, is, is that 19? Did you count the Helix life? Oh, no, I'm at 22. 22, okay. Sweet. What are you at, 19? Yeah. Okay. On the verse series, we take it seriously. <laughs> <laughs> so the problem with, like, I, man, I have the Supreme Verdict, and I really want to cast it and get rid of that Thrun, but then you can just get it back with Liliana. That's true, but once it has Regenerate up, then yeah, then never I'm stop just, it ever. Yeah. So I guess I have to do that. And make you, that this at least makes you waste your Liliana. Come on, land. Uh, ooh, that's actually not bad. I don't mind this play. All right, get your graveyard. Okay. All right, and I guess we should just play Dark Confidant, tick this up, say go. Okay, trigger. Ooh. Hmm, it's a good card. Hmm, I think we'll take the, yeah, we'll just go and take this. So <clears throat> I'm more, way more worried about Thrun than Dark Confidant. So we're going to just go ahead and bolt the, your Helix that thing. So you, you are going to draw another card, but... I'll take another card. Oh, well. Go. Ooh, oh, gosh. 15? By, by one card, I mean like 18 cards. All right, let's just trigger that. Collector Batilla. Ooh, can I escalate? Yes, you can. <laughs> that as is, far as I know. That is deep. Because you're just casting it. Yeah. Yeah, as far as I know. Yeah, you can just... I don't think I want to. Yeah, the, the only maybe. other mode, like, you're probably just going to do the, 
the duress me mode and then yeah but it's still like i could yeah I you could, could do I the could drain two yeah any of those cards would you rather it be like i lose two you gain two contextually yes i have a hazard in my hand and i don't think i ever want to take the time to do this so yeah, yeah. i'm just gonna drain you, you well, Lili you liliana will take out the cards from your hand so you can attack with your hazard yeah but i think i'm gonna want to cast them okay all right uh so all right you go to 17 i go to 23 and I get to look at your hand. You get a crypt command. What else? I have, I have a Jason and snap. snap and Jace. Rumble. Wait, do I want? Uh, maybe I just rumble with this. Okay. No, I'm gonna attack with both. Like, if you want to spend your time. Okay. If you just want to use a, a snapcaster just to block, I think I think I'm fine with that. Yeah. So our option is like, so I could like snap block here, play Jace next turn, minus bounce that. Um, then Jace is very vulnerable to that Raging Ravine. Um, could just take this next turn, snap Helix, and just have a snap out. Um, could snap block, play Jace, hopefully find a one mana spell, if not zero. Try to find like a one mana spell at removal spell, but it's still just vulnerable to the Ravine. Uh, we do get a, a couple looks here with Sir Trescanta also. Um, I got plenty of life. I'm at 23. Plenty of life. Um, how many cards do you have? Four. You have four. They're all so good. Well. They're just so good. Five. All right, I'm going to go with the Snap 18. Helix line next turn. Go for yep. it. 18 and... 17. Go to 17. Um, I guess I got... Kind of everything. Do I have a red white land in here somewhere? I think so. There we go. <clears throat> All right. Let's see what we got. Okay, let's go snap, yep, helix. Yep. That gain three, go back up to twenty, land and play tapped. Go ahead. Oh gosh. Uh position. Well I have a Jace the Mind Sculptor. Uh <laughs> Block. Alright, take three, go to fourteen. Go. Or no no, sorry, seventeen. Seventeen. Yeah. yeah. So seventeen all. That was good. Combat. Yeah. You don't have a thing, right? What do you mean a thing? The thingy. The no, colonnade. no colonnade. No, no yeah. colonnade. <clears throat> Snap. Target cryptic man. Sure. Blockers. Yep. Block. Do you want to use the cryptic yet? No. Nope. Hmm. Storm Pulse. All right, well, we'll just counter it and uh, see. You haven't played a land. I kind of want to bounce that ravine, but you just get to play the land. Yeah, we'll yeah. just draw a card. All right, counter and draw a card. Yeah, Thought Zeus. Okay, Serum Vision Jace. I will take the Jace. All right, Jace down. Go. Another Jace. <laughs> Rats. Draw. Serum Vision. Mm -hmm. Another Jace. Another Jace? Nope. Yeah, I'll keep that one, though. Um, actually drew another Serum Vision. Okay. We'll just do that. Did you top or bottom or anything? I topped one, bottomed the so other one. So you a card you want? Yeah. So um, it's a Force Cryptic Command? Um, yeah, let's see. Don't think I want either of those. Could could take the Serum Vision, I guess. <coughs> Definitely don't want the Spell Snare. Um, no, I'm just going just gonna to bottom them both. Shoot. All right. Well, and you say go, right? Yep. Go. Right. Pulse that. I'll counter draw card. <sighs> go. Untap. Escanta. Um, 
We don't need more Serum Vision. I will go ahead and flip as Kanta. Mm -hmm. As we search for more good cards, draw for turn. Pass turn. Card advantage in this deck is disgusting. Yeah. Oh, should I? I guess I conceded too early. <laughs> Punch by me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, we're here for game four now, and am I, am I right. three? Yeah. Yep. And I've got I've got the best start I could possibly dream of for this deck. Well, unless I don't hit lands, but All right. what what are you working with? I've, I got blue light control with with some ceremonies. Wow! Now you're just getting loose. <laughs> so here we are for another game where I go thought see, see no removal spells into you kill all my things. <laughs> yep. Um, That's, I just left the removal spells on top. Why would I want to get thought seize? All right, let's take a command. I guess let, let's let yeah, you. Yeah, take the good card. Yeah. Two colonnade. Since, yeah, I mean, I might want you to flood a little bit. Maybe I'm supposed to take a visions, but whatever. I'm taking a colonnade. Okay. Or I'm right. taking a crypt command. Um, you can pick it up. It's fine. Yeah, it's I same. think, I think I want to uh, fetch first instead of shocking in this hallowed fountain, just to be able to have the cards stay down at the bottom. You're gonna get a blue red. Um, yeah, let's get blue red. That's spire bluff now. <laughs> Can't get that one. That's Scalding Tarn. We got other blue-red lands, right? Okay, there. There's one. All right, so I'm down to 17. Yep. All right, cut. No, you're good. Ooh. All right, like that on top. Dark Confidant, go. <laughs> <laughs> Gain one. Go you're ahead. At, you're at 18 now? Yep. Dark Confidant, go. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> How is this real life? This game's easy. Take no two more. Go. 16. <laughs> I don't get it. What did I do to deserve this? All right, what answer do I need to find this turn? I don't know. I'm, I'm just going to top deck answers to whatever, whatever you have. Oh no, blood braid? Oh, that's a problem. Ooh. Oh no. This card a card, I'll put a dark confidant back in my hand. Oh no. Three you. Alright, thirteen. Go. Oh wow, you can just flip it right now. Yeah, and I think I want this card, I think. Are you gonna flip it or not? Um oh actually no, because then since I kept it, I don't have seven, so I don't get to. Um, oh sure. Yeah, I'll play that. Go ahead. Interesting. All right, combat? Yeah. 10? Yep. I don't want to just walk into a counter spell. Do I even have counter spells? Go. All right, snap bolt the blood rate off. Yep, kill the snapcaster, get blood rate off back. Dang. All right, untap. Trigger. Um, I don't. Yeah, I don't want that. And I'm gonna go ahead and flip. Mm -hmm. Um. All right. So as cancer costs three to activate. So I'm just gonna go ahead and pass turn. How do I ever win this game? All right, Tarmogoyf. Okay. Dark Confidant. Yep. Go. All right, so we're going to bolt Dark Confidant and activate <laughs> Escanta. One, two, three, four. Pick up Jace. This is disgusting. Untap. Draw. Dang it. I knew I shouldn't have taken Jace. Uh, hmm. Hmm. All right, Serum Vision, mm -hmm. draw, that was a good one. Scry those both to the bottom. And uh, I'll pass turn. You're at 10? Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
Um, Should be a 4 5, right? Instant sorcerer creature land. Yeah. I'm going to bounce the draw card. All right. I'm just trying to stay alive here. You know, that's not the best use of our cryptic command, but could take four, try to counter bounce, but. Don't really want to lose either of the cards in my hand. But I definitely needed to play two things this turn. You have three cards? Yep. One Jace. Yeah. All right, I'm going to fetch for just green, I think, or maybe black. Black. Yeah. So you're probably at like 18. Did you shock earlier? No. Okay. Uh, but I've I've thought seized. Okay. So 16. Uh, yeah. You probably did sh shock, right? Did the dark confident? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. 14. Yeah, because with that curve you did, I've... yeah. So I think you just went like one, two, three, and then blood braid four. So. I'm just gonna put both these into play and not activate Liliana and say go. Ooh. My two cards are too good. Well, I just don't think I can argue about discarding or using my cards in any other way. Well, this doesn't look good for us over here. Well, that's okay. We've we've had some other good games. <laughs> um, okay, I know the cards at the bottom of my library aren't that good. That leaves me with this. Yeah. All right, let's play Jace yeah. Zero. Oh wow! Oh god, that's not what we want. Um, put those two back. Fetch down to nine. Yep. Hmm. Could be dead. <laughs> probably should have just bounced the Tarmogoyf. That's probably too <laughs> cute. I, was, I thought, like, I hadn't seen a path the whole time. I thought I was going to see a path. Well, that's how you play magic. You just assume whatever is the best is on top is there for you. Yep. And you probably just drew a path. Your turn. And now you feel, now yeah. you feel great. I don't, I don't feel so bad. <laughs> I'm going to... No, I guess I'll just blow right off first. Okay. Trigger. It's I easy. guess I should keep a green up for that card, because there's nothing in my hand. Yeah. All right. Check up. So I have eight in play. Yep. Fine. Tech you. All right, I'm down to one. Go. Hmm. All right, we're going to zero. No. One, two, three, four, five, six. I want that and those. Put these two this way. Those two back. Yep. Um, go ahead. Discard. Okay. Combat. Uh, and you just have one card? Yeah. Hmm. I 
Okay, okay. Um, how? Okay, so I just tap your team, and then what? I guess I guess that's the best thing to do. All right, so we'll tap your team. Get blue, blue. Let's keep these two up, and then tap your team. Draw a card. Go. All right, end step, um, path, dues. Okay, I'm dead. Yep. Yeah. I just had well, path bolt. I had yeah. to play around Helix. Yep. All right, we're back here for game five, and uh, we actually have some good cards in our hand this time. <laughs> I thought he was actually going to hurt. All right, cool. Well, I've got hand disruption, so I'm, okay. I'm cool with that. Let's start with Scalding Tarn. All right. Ooh. Oh, wait. I should, I should cat. What am I doing? I... I'm yeah. not holding up a removal. I'm on, I'm actually on the play. So sorry. Yeah, you I'll don't take... have to hold up a removal. <laughs> <as well. laughs> yeah. All right. Never mind. All right. I, I shocked Steam Vents and uh, play Sarah Vision. This is gonna go get overgrown anyway. All right. Draw. Scry two. Um, I definitely want this card, and that card can I'm definitely keep in this, and then this one I think can go to the bottom. Well, I'm going to take a Snapcaster Mage. Okay. You have double Jace. So I'm at 18, you're at 17. 17. Yep. Double Jace. 2x Jace, Bolt, Flooded, and Glacial. Did you keep anything on top? Yeah, I kept one on top. Okay. 17-0. Yes, it is 17-0. 17-0. -0. All right, your turn. I'll go to 16 and play a Tarmogoyf off a of Swamp. Hmm. We can't bolt that. Well, I mean, we can, but... I mean, it's only a 2-3. No, it's a 3-4, actually. <laughs> yeah. And then bolt will make it a 4-5. I know. Um, I think I'm going to I think I'm gonna just pass turn. Drop. Um, what are you gonna do? Combat. All right, take three. Yep. Uh, thirteen for me. Play a spell bomb. Okay. And play a rage and ravine. Yep. And say go. Yep. Back two. Yep. Fourteen. Change in mind on playing Jace. All right. I'll play Jace and all minus. Just bounce that. All right. Exile your graveyard. Yep. Good. <sighs> Thoughtsies. Jace Bolt. Take the Jace. All right, puts you down to 12. Go. Um. And a zero. Yep. Why did you attack with this? Don't you hold it back to protect with Blood Braid Elf? What are you doing? No, nope, I'm racing. You're at 12. <laughs> I've been controlling too much today, Brad. Sometimes you got to race. Sometimes you got to attack. Feels good. Oh, none of this feels good. <laughs> All right, so we want... I think I'm just going to kind of have that and that. Okay, so this is my plan for this turn. I don't need. Then those definitely don't need this card for the next turn because that's how Jace works. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's so busted. Um, I think I 
I guess it doesn't it doesn't matter because I will yeah, have yeah. them both in my hand. Sweet. Um, go. <sighs> I get I get both. Okay. Yeah. I just I. I'm sorry for people at home that want to see this keep happening, but they're just. But no yeah, point. Jace is just gonna. Yeah, it just takes over. It just it just wins the game. Yeah, it just wins the game. So that is proof that Jace is not necessary. No, that's that it's, card is ridiculously good. Yeah, I mean, but even the rest of the Just Guy package is fine. Yeah, yeah, you just like, have t tons of cheap good spells. You know, Path, Bolt, Helix. All those, those cards are just so and good. powerful cards like Crypto Command, Search for yeah. Scanta, like these Snapcaster. things. Can, Snapcaster, these can win the the late game. Mm -hmm. You don't need Jace, and no. even Blood Red Elf kind of looked embarrassing at times. Like, <laughs> yeah, it was not on the same level. Yeah, we've seen like right now in modern Jeska controls like maybe the top deck already, yes. and I can't imagine them also getting Jace no. and Mind Sculptor. No, yeah, I, I I don't. I mean, John. To be fair, the John Jeskai matchups already significantly favored for Jeskai. Yeah. So we're we're already playing from behind, and Jace is a better card than Blood Bright Elf. Mm -hmm. But they don't fight each other well. They no. just don't. No, like especially if you don't have lightnings. Like maybe if you just pack well, a deck Command with lightnings. Command should be better than lightning. Right. right. Like, yeah, that's what I would think. Yeah. Yeah. So it's going to be better against the rest of the field where. Where that's the cost. Like, mm -hmm. if these were both standard decks, sure, maybe Blightning's better than K Command when you only play three or four different decks. But mm -hmm. there's no way you're going to be able to argue, be like, well, Blightning's good against Jace. It's like, <laughs> well, K Command is the only way you can ever beat Affinity. Right, yeah. Like, just... you need this card. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, I think that Blood Bright Elf would be a safe unbanned, but I don't even want it to because I don't even want to start the fight of, like, well, if Jun Guy gets Blood Bright Elf, yeah. we get Jace. And it's like, we got to make sure Jay stays banned forever in this mm -hmm. format. I think it's way too good. Mm -hmm. um, and, and the games just aren't fun. Because, no. like, let's say you're in a tournament, you know, you're going to keep playing that game. But yeah. I'm just going to sit there and just do a million things. And we're going to we're going to waste 15 minutes of our life. Oh, yeah. No, and you have like, you, like you know, whenever you stopped playing, it wasn't because like, oh, you're tired of playing. No, you had zero percent chance of winning the game. No, I could never <laughs> win. Like, yeah, there's just no way I'm going to win this game. I played enough games yeah. like this. Yeah. Yeah. I, I don't have any resources. My resources are resource denial for both players, while your resources are we. I get to do everything. <laughs> right. But you just can't win that game. No. Um, but yeah, so that's test. That's our test now. Mm -hmm. um, join us later this week, where Todd Anderson and I are going to be doing a really fun one. Mm -hmm. We're playing Reed Duke seventy five from GP Miami Jund. Mm -hmm. Standard. Standard versus the list of Teamer that I played at the Invitational. All so right. it is Teamer Energy versus Jund. Now, if Teamer beats Jund, Todd and I are going to next week do Cobblade versus Teamer. Wait, wait no, oh, Band no, Company. Band Company, yeah. Band Company. We already yeah. thought that Cobblade would lose. Yeah, we already thought Cobblade We already thought that Cobblade would lose to Teamer. Yeah. So uh, if it gets through Band Company, maybe we do still have to do Cobblade. Okay, yeah, that's like the final boss? That's yeah, the end that's boss? Yeah, that's the All end right. boss. Okay. Um, but yeah, so this Friday, join Todd and I on Premium for Jund versus Teamer. Mm -hmm. And we're going to see if like Rakdos' return and... Bonfire and Thrag yep. Dust can stand up against. Do you Glory have uh, Do you have Thunderball Hellkite? Is that in there? Um, is that going to do like one damage to like the Thopters and stuff? It could, but I don't think that it was played back then. Okay, yeah, I wasn't sure if it does. Yeah, well, it has Bonfire. Yeah, it has Bonfire, you have which is real good. And you got a bunch of Hunt Masters. Return. Hunt Master matches up well against Rogue Refiner. Okay, it is true, and you can't flip it if you Vizier it. Mm -hmm. mm, so I don't get true. to flip into yeah, he was powerful, a, yeah. Yeah. Okay. But it's gonna be a fun one, so join us then and we'll be back with some more holiday fun. Mm -hmm. Uh if you have any ideas of, of matchups you'd like to see mm -hmm. or cards you'd like to see on band, I will not do no ba no ban list modern. modern yeah. I just think it's stupid. Right. It's not even the same format. Well, we're, we're definitely gonna do the other standard next time if Teamer wins, which we're assuming. Teamer for sure. So we're gonna yeah. have like Teamer go through like the gauntlet of like the best decks. Yes. Like can and anything then, knock at, it at down? At the end we'll be like, Teamer <laughs> is the best standard deck ever, and what everyone about, that watches is like, yeah, we already knew that. What like, about this teamer against Aetherworks Marvel? Okay, well, that's the same format. It's already Aetherworks Marvel is the banned card from Teamer. Yeah. So we don't need to play that. You get the Ixalan cards. But All those Ixalan cards. It's already a, a ton thing. of them. We are recording right now, sir. Yeah, we <laughs> yeah. sure are. What are we talking about? <laughs> we're talking about... <laughs> oh, we got some world champs in here? What are we yeah. talking about? We're talking about how we're going to put Teamer Energy against... Uh, Jund. Against Jund. And yeah. if it wins that, ban Company. Okay. And then if it wins that... Cobblade. Cobblade. Cobblade wins we're everything. You well, think so? You think so? You don't think it's complicated. Well, you, you get they you get a break. It's okay. They can kind of hear me. Yeah. They, can, they cannot hear or see you, Cedric. Okay, I gotta move in. Yeah, you gotta yeah. move in. There you go. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So, but you get a braid to take out Batterskull. You get Whirler Virtuoso. They can make Thopters to block to block the Squadron Hawks. Okay. 
Uh, that's about all anyway, I got so far. Anyway, we're going to just cut this because <laughs> Seth Drake is here. But thanks for watching, everyone. Join us later on the Versus Series where Todd Anderson and I will be doing battle John versus Teamer. All See right. you then. Bye, everybody. What are you doing? <laughs>